Uh, hi guys, I cannot wait to Sunday. I have not been this excited in a long while because it's just gonna be a new product out there. It's gonna be something different, something exciting. Um, I'm, I feel I feel real I feel good about the Ezekiel Elliott uh, situation. I, I read all the um, the the things that I could read on it or whatever, and it made me feel okay about the situation. There were some things concerning uh, some stuff in there, uh, drug tests and stuff like that. That's that's probably going to be looked at by the by the league. But that stuff it doesn't bother me as much as as someone that could put his hands on a female so I, I I feel I feel I feel like I can support him 100% right now so I, I and that and that was like what I needed to move on because if, if, if there was some part of something that made me worry that this this kid had a problem in that area not the weed I don't care about the weed the, the, the weed to me be straight up honest with you the weed problem is the NFL problem you know, you know what I'm saying they need to get with the world because it's hard to walk around states like California and states that are legal in, in, in marijuana without being in the room and ha getting secondhand smoke, without being in a car with people that's just going to fire one up or secondhand smoke anywhere that you could fail a test with. So the N NFL needs to need, needs to look around and look in the cities and look what's going on because you know what's going on with Carolina down there ain't the same thing that's happening out here with the LA Rams. The LA Rams got to deal with more stuff than than the camp that Panthers do if you know what I'm saying so these areas are different in America and the NFL is gonna have to up their their game or up their rule book in, in accordance so that's that uh, but this weekend I'm gonna be on line probably Saturday night all Saturday night I'm gonna be online because I'm gonna be in too excited we'll talk about the Tony Romo situation this hand hurts uh, We'll talk about the Tony Romo situation. We'll talk about Dak, what, I, what I'm feeling. And I'll tell you straight up, I, I really want this to be the new era moving forward simply because, simply, and, and hear me out right here, if you and I, all of us, want and need Romo in week whatever he comes back, that would mean that we have seen some things we really don't like in Dak or some things that's really going to question us in Dak. So that I don't want. I want him to, I want us to see him as the future and if you see him as the future then you have to treat him like the future and give him as much reps and give him as much experience because that's going to benefit us on the back end everybody know that that just makes all the sense in the world but we'll talk that through we'll talk the team through we'll talk everything through i'll probably be playing mad i'm 2-0 in my madden league i can't believe that i'm, I'm always i always start the start the start of the season because i'm so invested in football i usually start off like 0-3 0-4 and, oh and, oh and I've, I've won two games in a row what what the hell all right guys i'll see you saturday night shango live i don't know what time yet just look at my tweets and, I, and i'll keep you updated but until then I'll be on Madden probably, and I'll be as excited as ever for football on Sunday. All right, holla at you. Peace.